Hello again. I'm back with another like sketch with me kind of video. Um, I really like making these because I think they're the most comfortable for me to film, and also it's not so much pressure because I can really just film myself sketching a little bit and then um, yeah share one of one or two of those pages um, and I thought today I would talk a little bit about my process like how I pick references and like what I like to do with them um, so I'm actually gonna show this reference later on but it was kind of a challenge for myself because it's not the kind of um, like object or subject I usually draw um, but I really like the all of the folds and like nitty details which is super cool like the image is very well done but that is also what I find hard about that um, I think it's because I focus a lot on faces especially more so in the past and so I kind of struggle with these more um, complicated like images and with this one you can also see later on that I kind of struggled with some of the mid parts um, like in the middle of the horse of the body um, I think it looks kind of messy because I got lost with what kind of details to, sh to show and what not to and um, yeah maybe I should have been more careful I think I tend to be a bit impatient um, but with this one I wanted to focus on the shapes a lot and on light and darkness so that's what I'm kind, kind of trying to do lately more so focusing less on line and more so on value um, and that's why I blocked in everything with pencil first and now I'm going over it with my like liner I guess um, yeah I also kind of try to exaggerate the legs especially and the perspective slightly although it's already um, like quite stretched out um, overall yeah I think I can definitely learn more from this and try to be a bit more creative too with the subjects I do I mean this is just obviously my what I do for fun I would say and for practice but you learn stuff from that for like pieces for later um, yeah and then um, this is just, I just wanted to sketch some faces, <laughs> which it's just my comfort zone, I guess. I think I wouldn't have drawn this maybe if I wasn't trying to film something because I wanted to upload something again. And um, I was I was wanting to draw, but not really. And it's not that I'm making myself do this, but it was kind of motivating. Um, like just a thought to share it afterwards and so I think usually when I don't know what to draw I just go back to drawing faces, portraits, that kind of stuff um, and yeah it's, I went with a similar kind of style as with the image before um, which is fun because I used to hate this kind of media mixing pencil and ink but it actually looks very nice um, yeah I like I like I like it <laughs> mm, I also wanted to say that I wouldn't say or think that I have a very like picturesque sketchbook or anything like that I'm definitely not a like perfectionistic perfect perfectionist at all um, but if anyone sees this and is like, um, why do I draw ugly stuff sometimes or whatever, um, I think on this page especially, I did like two 
or maybe even three sketches that I kind of started and even like got kind of far and then I was just like I, I just don't like this at all and I just erased it and I think there's no shame in that I just don't show it because it's like <laughs> like it's not very interesting um, but yeah I thought I'd just let you know that and it's also fine to, to keep it in but I don't know um yeah so i this this lower one is actually the kid from the movie lion which i watched recently actually when i was with my parents um and it's such a good movie and the kid that played the kid <laughs> i don't know you you would know it if you watched the movie but he did an amazing job and so i wanted to draw him but I realized I can't draw kids at all. So I struggled a lot with this one for some reason. Um, but yeah, I would recommend you to watch the film if you like. Because I really liked it. Like it was very emotional. But just, yeah, just a good one. And yeah, I think I'll leave it at that. In the video I have still have left like a few minutes but um, I'll just let you watch the process So that's basically it, I just like to add some kind of design elements at the end and then I also sprayed it with fixative so it doesn't get all over the place. Um, but yeah, if you're still here, um, please let me know like what kind of videos um, you would like to watch, like if you kind of prefer these videos like I have been doing that are more like sketch with me and then with a voiceover or maybe you would like one without a voiceover and just like music or just whatever um, just let me know your recommendations and thanks again for watching